Hi there. I'm Ribbit Rabbit, and these are my friends. Hello. I'm Squeaky Squirrel. Hey, hey, hey. I'm Kevin Cat. Whoops. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> I'm Dilly Duck. Now let's learn English together and we'll all be superstars! Yay! Rain, rain, go away! Continuous tenses. It has been raining all day. Ribby, Squicky, Kevin, and Dilly are playing some indoor games. Ribby and Kevin are playing carom. The game is getting more exciting. Kevin is trying his best to strike out Ribby's men. Squicky and Dilly are playing Scrabble. They're focusing on the words. They are trying to outdo each other by making as many words as possible. While they were playing, the rain stopped. They didn't even notice. They were having such a good time with each other. <sighs> time flies fast. We had such a good time here. We must meet again to play. The friends decided that they will be meeting again for another round of Carom and Scrabble. enjoyed playing the board games due to the rain. The rain was truly a blessing in disguise. Oh, what fun we had. What are we going to learn about grammar today? Let's learn about the continuous tense. Continuous tense is used to describe a continuing action. There are three types of continuous tenses. Present continuous tense, past continuous tense, and future continuous tense. They're respectively formed with the present, past, or future of the verb to be, and are always followed by verbs that end with ing. Let's look at some examples from the story. Let's begin with present continuous tense. The game is getting exciting. Is getting is a present continuous tense. It is formed with the present form of the verb to be is. Next, let's look at the past continuous tense. They were having such a good time with each other. Were having is a past continuous tense. It is formed with the past form of the verb to be are, which is were. Finally, let's look at an example of future continuous tense. The friends decided that they will be meeting again for another round of carom and scrabble. Will be meeting is a future continuous tense. It is formed with the future form of the verb to be, which is will. Therefore, is getting, were having, and will be meeting are continuous tenses. It's story time! Today's story is Scenes at the Beach. Let's look at what people do at the beach. Two children are building sandcastles. A group of teenagers are playing beach volleyball. Many people are swimming and splashing water at one another in the sea. There are also a few children playing with the ball. Higher up in the sky, seagulls are flying freely calling out to each other. What are some of the continuous tenses you can see in the story? 
Let's find them together. The story uses present continuous tense. Two children are building sandcastles. A group of teenagers are playing beach volleyball. Many people are swimming and splashing water at one another in the sea. There are also a few children playing with a ball. Higher up in the sky, seagulls are flying freely and calling out to each other. Now, let's change these sentences to the past continuous tense. Are you ready? Let's begin! Two children are building sandcastles. We can change this to... Two children were building sandcastles. A group of teenagers are playing beach volleyball. We can change this to... A group of teenagers were playing beach volleyball. Many people are swimming and splashing water at one another in the sea. We can change this to... Many people were swimming and splashing water at one another in the sea. There are also a few children playing with a ball. We can change this to... There were also a few children playing with a ball. Higher up in the sky, seagulls are flying freely and calling out to each other. We can change this to... Higher up in the sky, seagulls were flying freely and calling out to each other. Now, you can work with a friend to change the sentences to future continuous tense. Have fun! Please put your hands together for the words of the day. Carom. Carom. Carom can be played by either two or four people. Scrabble. Scrabble. Scrabble is a word game. Raining. Raining. It has been raining heavily since morning. Thunder. Thunder. The children are scared of the loud thunder. Board games. Board games. Carom and Scrabble are board games. Spelling and pronunciation. Let's spell and say the following words. B, E, A, C, H. Beach. B, E, A, C, H. Beach. B, O, L, L. Cheese. 
seagulls. S E A G U L L S. Seagulls. Activity. Look at this picture. This is a scene outside Kylie's home. What are Kylie and her family doing? Looks like fun, doesn't it? Make sentences using words ending with ing. Hmm, let me see. James is watering the plants. Well done. Let me see. Kylie is listening to music. Yes, that must be her favorite song. <laughs> Mother is drinking a cup of tea. Fantastic! Keep going, Squicky. Let me see. Father is reading the newspapers. Way to go! Now just give me one more sentence. Hmm. The ducks are swimming in the pond. You did it! That was impressive. Well done. We learned a lot of things today. I'm glad we did. We learned about the present continuous tense, past continuous tense, and the future continuous tense. A few new words! And how to spell and pronounce some of the words from a story. That was indeed fun! English is fun! Until next time, have fun!